Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Winding Away with Corey and Ray. Thank you for joining us again. And today's episode is going to feature an Austrian red. This is our first of 2021. It is. And we thought we'd start off with something a little Austrian. Something a little different to go with the different year we're already having. Um, it's a Zweigelt, correct? Yeah. And it's a Force Strider 2015. And it's between 10 and $12 a bottle. And it is from Niederösterreich, Austria. Is that correct? Yes. Now, this is one of Ray's favorite varieties. So tell me. Yes, no, bit. I love Zweigelt. Zweigelt, uh, you know, thick Pinot Noir and Beaujolais if they had a baby and they went to Austria. Exactly right. People compare it to Beaujolais all the time. Um, it's light, but it's got nice fruit. Um, Pretty color. You know, I have a lot of customers that uh, only drink red. And so if they're eating chicken or pork or even some seafoods, they want a red. This is a perfect red to have when you would usually have a white. Because it's not overbearing. It's not, you know, big. It's very easy drinking. It's just got great flavor to it. They're not expensive, like you just said, 10 to 12 bucks. Um, yeah, I, I love Zweigelt, and uh, I've always had great success with handing these Do a lot out. of liquor stores carry it at wine shops? Uh, I had never even heard of it until you. And... I would not say a lot. Okay. But the, the ones where you feel like these guys know what they're talking about will probably have a Zweigelt. Okay, for instance, I got this at Wegmans Wines in Princeton. Um, they, they do carry a lot of varietals. Um, I like their, they have stuff from everywhere. They even have a whole entire New Jersey section, a New York section um, of beers and wines. So, but this is great. You get a lot of cherry and you definitely get cinnamon. There's definitely baking spice in there. Um, cherry is certainly very common. A little raspberry to it. I mean, it's got 13%. It's not, you know, no. got a little, little, little kick to it. Now, when it first goes in, you get a lot of the fruit and the cherries. And then at the end, there's like this little tartness. It's, I guess, eat it, like eating a cherry almost. How, it, like, you get that sweetness, but then you do get a little bit of pucker, right? Yeah, no, it's very velvety. Um, it's excellent food wine because, like I said, it's not overpowering. Um, so really good with chicken, any kind of chicken. I always recommend this. Okay. Um, I saw somebody saying that they ate it with um, pork and sauerkraut or like German and Austrian dishes. A lot of, a lot of reviews on Vivino and other places were comparing, you know, that because this is from that, you know, ethnicity, that it's good to pair with those. Well, it's Austrian. Absolutely. So, I mean, you know, they make Italian wine to go with Italian food. Austrian mm -hmm. wine, I'm sure, is meant to be eaten with Austrian food. So the next time you're having a or Wiener trying. schnitzel... Grab yourself a bottle of Zweigelt. Zweigelt. Now they say it's good to have it a little chilled, yes? This is a red that you can also put a little chill on. So this is a good one in the summer. I hand out a lot of Zweigelt during the warmer months when somebody's like, I want red, but, you know, I, I want something that I can have, you know, a little cold. Right, and at a picnic is... or a barbecue or keep it a cooler or put it, you know, take on your boat or whatever you want to have it cold. This Throw is, it with everything yeah, else. This, this is, is great. This is absolutely a red that can handle a little bit of a chill. I love it. I love it. Now, do you carry any at your store? I do carry a Zweigel. I don't carry this particular one, but I do. And um, I brought one in because we didn't have one when I started where I'm at. And uh, it's been selling really well. So, well, see. So off to a good start with our Zweigel. So, if you're in the Cranford area and you want to try one because you can't find it anywhere else, go see Ray. He'll hook you up with the one that he has. Just say, yeah. <laughs> I where, know where, what you mean. Wear your leader hosen in and skip on over to see Ray for your Zweigelt. You want to talk about the sound of music or a nice <laughs> glass of Zweigelt? This oh. is one of my favorite things. Oh, no. As long as he doesn't start singing, we're good. <laughs> oh, Ray drop some rope. How do you <laughs> anyway, um, thank you for joining us again. We're hoping this year... We can bring you a lot more interesting things and get back into the studio, fingers crossed, and have in-person guests again and try to get back to normal life. Say ya to Zweigelt. 
And as always, good wine. Good friends. Great, great life. life. These are a few are of my favorite things. things.